Hi, I'm Kevin Lucas with Valley Chrome Plating in Clovis, California. Valley Chrome Plating is a manufacturer of aftermarket diesel truck parts. We do semi-truck bumpers, cab panels, visors, things like that. Any decorative chrome that you can put on a diesel truck. So when you're building 300 bumpers a day, you've got a lot of product moving around a manufacturing facility and it's important to make sure that everything's moving in a timely manner and knowing where everything is in that process becomes very important. Initially we were tracking all the parts with just a handheld system where an employee was responsible for scanning each and every part as it came by them and it just wasn't becoming reliable enough when you're spending dozens of man hours every day just trying to find out where a specific part is because it should be done or it's, no one knows where it is, things like that. I actually got a mailer from Metalcraft saying that they released an on-metal RFID tech and I was like, oh, well that's, that sounds great, I need to try that. We chose RFID technology because it was hands-off. I didn't have to rely on a person to do the scanning. We just knew that it would see it and it would work every time. The role of RFID in our process is to be able to track and locate parts as they're moving through the manufacturing process. So our manufacturing process begins with sheets of flat steel. Uh, they come in by truck, we unload them, and then they are loaded into a laser system. The laser will cut the product out of the steel and then it gets offloaded and put into a, basically a rack. From there, a robot picks up the bumpers, puts them into a polishing machine. They're polished to a very fine finish and then they are offloaded to the polishing machine and then they get pressed and that's where they take on more of their final shape of the bumper. At that point, we can put a tag on it because the other processes would destroy any kind of labeling you could do to it. So they get a label, they get their bolt holes and light holes cut in them, and then they get put onto a production line, and that's the first point where there's antennas there that read the tags as they go by. The Metalcraft tags have performed very well. They have a very good read range, they're very durable. Uh, it's a very hostile work environment. The, the fact that they even make it through the whole thing and still read at the end is very impressive. Metalcraft's RFID tags have been a game changer for us. They've really improved our tracking of products through the manufacturing process and made things much smoother around here.